Good day, good day! <laughs> How the honk are you? Welcome to Roverland. We have got a continuation with the uh, Matchbox Land Rover 90. Yes! And uh, we are going to be looking from, uh, well, uh, actually, um, uh, yeah, it's going to be... Uh, the end, <laughs> kind of, kind of the end, but not the end. All right. Well, let's. Uh, first off, I gotta do some uh, first a shout out. Uh, one to Joey Bobeyer. Uh We were. I talked last video, and uh, we'll tag this video up there. Uh, number fifty three, variation number fifty three. This came in a five pack, two thousand seven. And I had forgotten all about this, but Joey over on Facebook reminded me, Dan, you didn't pick out the best thing ever on this vehicle. My other Land Rover is a Matchbox. I've forgotten all about that. So thanks a lot to Joey for uh, pointing that out over on um, Facebook, Roverland. One of the coolest things about this model. The other thing that I've got to mention before I get too far is uh, number 48 came out in 2006. And uh, I showed you a picture of it. Sorry for the glare. A picture of it on um, BAMCA.org. And that's where I'm getting a lot of my, or all my information from. Go over and check them out. They're totally cool. But anyway, I said I didn't have this number 48, but I do. It comes in a gift set, Mummy's Gold Activity Action Pack. And uh, yeah, and so I do have one, and only one, and it is in the package. I thought I did. <laughs> the funny story was, is I looked at my uh, shelf. I've got a shelf, bookshelf, that um, just has my 10 packs on it, and I didn't see it. Well, that's because this one was set up on the top shelf because this is so special. I only have one. And, uh, yeah, so it was on the top shelf, and I was looking at all, uh, all the, what is it, three other shelves that I have? of 10 packs so anyway there you go i have to tell you that i had number 48 all right so we're going to be moving right along now the next section that we're going to be talking about and uh, starts with this one here and um but this is not the um MB 180. This is called the MB 721. And the reason for that is, is up until this time, they have all been metal bases. Now it has got a plastic base. And uh, so this one here is in China. So a little bit different. Same kind of uh, base. Uh, it resembles the, the metal one, but now we're into a plastic base and then, of course, the plastic top. So, this one is uh, number 55, 2007, and this came in a uh, huge play set. And, uh, man, it's just huge. I, I don't even know how to show it to you. It's just so big. <laughs> It's just so big. I just don't know how to show it to you. So I'm going to try, and uh, we're going to see what it looks like. All right. Um, yeah, it's just big. Big, huge play set. And you can see that the car is in the corner here. And I I just don't know. I mean, it's huge. Um, uh, let's see if we can get a measurement on it. Boy, I... I I was trying to figure out how to show you how big this thing was. Well, that's 12 inches. And so it's like 18 inches by a foot tall, practically. Uh, it's about uh, four and a half uh, inches deep. 
but it's a huge play set and uh, just humongous. And uh, yeah, Jeep and Land Rover on it. Awesome. No assembly. Diecast car included. So this is an exclusive playset only. And uh, yeah, it's just crazy. Let me turn it around here. And we can take a look at the back here. Huge set. And there's a Land Rover again. Pirate car. Tromping croc golden treasure for pirate zones and now which is interesting and this is the pirate land pop-up adventures hook yourself an adventure what is interesting is is there is a blue land rover on there that i don't know it's if it's in the thing or not um I, this is the only one that i have and uh, I'm not opening it. <laughs> so I don't know if that's another variation. Nobody else has ever had. Uh, I've never seen it. Uh, and I would always like to uh, make one uh, custom, you know, and copy that and uh, have it as, uh, you know, display. So there you go. And you can see the car itself is in here. So very awesome. Uh, that's the one and only thing I've got of this uh, number 55 and it's the Pirate Island. So black plastic base now, red. It's got the mud splatter on it, the skull and uh, swords, gray interior, clear windows, black uh, roof with the, uh, now they call this five crown dot wheel and they're brown. They have matchbox on them. Really kind of cool. Really kind of cool. All right. So let's move on to number 56, which is this one here. And 20, uh, 2009 Safari Adventure, as you see there, little Land Rover uh, badge. And uh, that would be giraffe print. Now, this was a... Uh, well, you know what? I'm out of order. Yeah, that's not that's not it. No, that's later. Sorry. This is number 56. I gotta look at my notes. <laughs> this is number 56. This is uh, 2009. So white top, yellow, and it is the Dino Search Archaeologist. Yes, the 721. That car must have rolled in, out of place, and that's why it was thrown off. So now this has got a Thailand plastic base uh, stamped with the uh, production week and stuff, 152nd scale. So it's uh, yellow with uh, mud splatter on it. Now these they call uh, ringed flower, and these came in... Uh, Oh, I didn't show you these. I I can't believe this. I, sh I should have showed you. Man, I am just so excited. Uh, I have four of these pirate cars all by themselves. Uh, unbelievable. And they're all in very good shape. Uh, I mean, this came in a play set. Huge play set. I don't know what that retailed for, but I got four of those. I bought them off eBay. Uh, I might have found some. Well, I think this one... I found at a store. It's got a price sticker on it, but I mean, it's it's remarkable that it came in this big, huge playset, and I got four of them. So anyway, going back to the the yellow one here, this one came in a five pack exclusive, and we'll take a look at that five pack. And this was um, they really didn't um, give them names. Uh, I guess is the Dino Research. Uh, you know, because of the, the logo on there, they all have that Dino Research logo on there, so I guess that's what it is. But uh, pretty, pretty cool. But uh, yeah, so that was a five pack for um, the yellow one. All right, that was number 56, 2009. All right, now we're going to go to number 57. And still in 2009 is the beige one. Sorry, I'm back on track. 
Boy, so they call that a beige, white roof, black base, Thailand, and black interior, kind of a smoke window. They kind of call that a smoke window. And then with the ring flower. Now this one, um, oh, I didn't show you. Oh boy, I tell you, I'm, I'm just getting so excited. Let's go back down here. So you can see I have seven of these uh, archaeologist ones loose, and then I have one on the uh, five pack. So this one here, uh, the beige one, uh, Safari Adventure, came in a 10 pack. And here is the 10 pack. And there is the beige. Now that, uh, yeah, I like this, this teeth on that one. That, yeah. So anyway, very, very cool. That really, again, not, um, not anything in particular as far as, you know, the, uh, set name or anything like that, but really kind of cool. All right, so that was uh, number 57. So number 58 is this one here, the Jungle Adventure, which is uh, metallic turquoise. Yes, beautiful metallic turquoise. Adventure, uh, Jungle Adventure Tours, number 26, white with the uh, ring rose there. Uh, ring flower, excuse me, black interior, smoke windows again, white top, and this one has a black Thailand plastic base. Very, very interesting. Now, number uh, 58 came out in 2012, and uh, you can see I have uh, four of them. Uh, some of these are kind of in rougher shape than others. Whoa. Uh, this one is probably my, my worst this rust shape one. Uh, but still in pretty good nick. The uh, bull bar was, uh, but uh, yeah, so I got the, that one really, holy cow, somebody, somebody ran into a rhino there on the, well, come on, let's focus. Somebody ran into a rhino there on the old bull bar, didn't they? All right, so anyway, so I have four of those loose, and I have two of the gift packs. I don't know why this is so close, but this is so close. <laughs> so anyway, so once again, uh, five pack, it's uh, second from the top. Uh, no, well, yeah, Jungle Adventure five pack. So they started uh, naming stuff finally. Here is the back. Uh, very, very interesting. Yeah. Play on the edge with cliffhanger playset. Wow. And so that came out in uh, 2012. And uh, like I say, I got two of those and four loose. So the next and final one came out in uh, 2012, number 59, which is the end of this era. And ba bam, here it is. Oh. Dan, oh, it seems like that looks like the same as before. Well, it is. But this time, it's from a 10-pack, which I don't have, and it has a modified base to it. All right, you can remember the last one, right? No. <laughs> so here they are. This is, the top one is the uh, early edition 2012 out of the 5-pack, and the bottom one is the later edition of 2012 out of the 10 pack. And you can see how they modified that all up and everything with uh, the made in Thailand and more uh, stuff. And now, interestingly enough, they, they stopped spelling out the 90 and they just call it the Land Rover 90. But still, uh, 2006 is the copyright for this base. So there you go. That's what we've got. This is, uh, so anyway, I, I don't have a 10 pack of those, but I do have three loose and they all have that whole chapter written on the bottom of them. Look at that. Holy cow. 
So I got one, uh, once again, the old bull bar gets uh, tangled up there. Uh, and I, I've never really seen a 10 pack with one of these in, or I'd try to get it because, uh, that's kind of interesting, but, um, there you go. Wow. That's it for the MB721, which is a modification, uh, plastic base of the MB180. So we only have one more set of Matchbox Land Rover 90s to go. So don't miss that. That'll be coming out uh, this week. I'm, I'm hoping, I'm planning. And uh, yeah, so come over to Facebook. Hey, drop me a line. Show me what you got. Tell me if I missed something cool and exciting on these things. Because there's so much to see. And I'm trying to just show you what I've got. What the, you know, the jig is on these. Where they came in what? The single pack, five pack, ten pack, play set. So, yeah, I love your guys' feedback for sure. All right, well, we got to get out of here. You guys have a great day. Uh, oh, as always, remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great Rover Day.